What's going on, guys? Tuesday night in the NBA, generally a slower night, Tuesday and Thursdays. We only got four games on the slate. Um, but we do have some pretty expensive players here. You know, you have Harden and Westbrook still on the card. People generally like to take the nights off on Tuesday and Thursday of tournaments and focus on their cash games to make money because the tournaments are harder to win. you got to be more perfect with only four lineups. So many players are highly owned and shared with other people. So I'm going to try and win this tournament tonight. I'm going to try and avoid Russell Westbrook because he's probably going to be 70%, 75% owned on a four-game slate. So we're going to start a point guard here with uh, – Two players who are two value plays going against each other tonight. Let's start off with Shelvin Mack, 4,700, Utah Jazz. Okay, this guy's going to be pretty highly owned as well. He's cheap. D'Angelo Russell is a very bad defender for the Los Angeles Lakers. He played 34 minutes last game because George Hill and Dante Exum are both ruled out again. Put up 28 FanDuel points. That's five and a half, six times value there at 4,700. Easy play to plug in for me there. Let's stay a point guard, guys. I'm going to roll with D'Angelo Russell. Same game. 5,600 Los Angeles Lakers now. He's put up 28 FanDuel points in three of the last four. I see him exploding tonight for over 40. He's going to have a big game. 32 FanDuel points, or 32 minutes every night. I see him putting up over 40, like I just said. Shelvin Mack, a smaller defender, generally comes off the bench and is a scoring point guard. So I think these two guys are going to be going at it tonight at 5,600 and 4,700. Lock them in there. You can save up. All right, now that we saved up at point guard, let's go to shooting guard here. We've got to get one stud in there. James Harden, 11,400 Houston Rockets. Now I don't got to give you any stats or any info on this guy. It's James Harden, the beard. You know how good he is. He's going against the Dallas Mavericks in Texas tonight. It's going to be a shootout run and gun game. High over under total there. Um, plays like the point guard, always has the ball in his hands. He's going to go for his general 50 FanDuel points. I see 60 tonight against the Mavericks, who are bottom four in the league against the shooting guard. He's going to have a big night there. All right, now let's go to small forward here. Let's roll with Justice Winslow, 5,200 Miami Heat. Okay, now Victor Oladipo has rolled out again. He's a good defender, so he'll be getting whoever's starting out there for the Thunder. Um, he put up 48 FanDuel points two games ago. He's been over 23 in all the last four, so he's getting four and a half to five times value. I see him going for over 30 tonight. It's at six times value for Justice Winslow, and it's an easy play for me. Small forward, a very ugly position, so I'm going to roll with Justice Winslow there at 5,200. All right, now let's go to center. Had his man there last night. He put up 22 FanDuel points at 4,300. Let's stick with him. Montrez Harrell. Okay, he's starting again, guys. Um, he didn't blow you away, but he got got you what you needed where you can save up and spend. You know, at 14 points last night. Didn't do as well in the rebounding category. If it would have been his normal stuff in the rebounding, he would have had a big night. Um, I think he stays about where he's at between 25 and 30 FanDuel points, and that's five to six times value, and that's all you need there. And... Uh, it's a pretty easy play for me. Also, Dallas is very bad everywhere on defense. All right, now, guys, let's go to my beast of the night. Okay, guys, now Russell Westbrook, like I said, jumps off the page at 13,000. But if you want to win a tournament, I'm going to try and avoid him. If you can keep Russell under 55, 50 points, then you're not getting value out of him. This matchup just jumped off the page here at small forward. Utah Jazz, Gordon Hayward, 7,800. Okay, you played the Lakers last time. Um, he put up 42 FanDuel points, which is a very good total. It's over five and a half times value on this guy. But tonight I see him going for over 50. The Lakers are, I attack them everywhere. You know I love attacking the Lakers and the Nets more than any two teams. Gordon Hayward, I think, scores 30 actual basketball points tonight. You know, five assists, five rebounds, steal, and a block. Gets him up to 50, guys. Okay, he's going to have his highest return on investment tonight. It's going to be Gordon Hayward. Lock him in there. And uh, like I said, I'm trying to win this tournament. I'm not trying to, not trying to roster West, Westbrook tonight, guys. I know it's crazy advice, but I'm, that's what I'm doing. I'm trying to win this fifty thousand dollars first place prize. All right, guys, good luck.